Hello everyone and welcome to another Mario Builder 64 video. Today we are playing Haunted Docks. I saw this one didn't have a lot of thumbs up on the Discord, so hopefully I can give this guy some feedback because he said he wanted some feedback. If you don't know what I do in these videos, I play through the level, get all the stars, and then I go through and say what I liked and disliked about the level. And this level is made by the Dry Bone, and there are seven stars. One is the eight red coin star and the other is the 80 coin star so five stars after the two coin stars let's go ahead and get into it right off the bat i am noticing a whole lot of lag so that means this level is probably stuffed with stuff but we will see i'm really hoping that the entire level doesn't have this problem I'm not really sure what those platforms are for. I'm assuming there's something underneath those red blocks right there. Let's go back to this platform over here. Man, I feel like I'm playing in molasses or something. This is ridiculous. Right off the bat, I can say I would rather the level be smaller and less detailed or have less, less going on if it means that it actually runs good. So there's one red coin. It looks like some of the red coins are going to be in the water this time. I saw one. Oh, there's more over there. I'm gonna try to get this one done a lot faster than the video yesterday because that video yesterday went on for almost an hour and it was partially due to me just being kind of stupid and not realizing that I could wall jump a particular way. So hopefully today I don't have a brain fart moment like I did yesterday. And I'm assuming maybe more of the red coins are just in this little bomb maze or something. Well, there's the red coin star, so yeah, this is going to be... This is going to be how you get all the red coins, I guess. This is going to be underneath here. So I see one more over there. The another one over there. We'll say I'm not really having trouble... Navigating these mines. So I don't know if they're just not really placed very well or if it's meant to be that easy. It's a decent little scavenger hunt, I guess. It just looks very random and messy. And that's not necessarily the best look. To, that's not necessarily the look you want to go for when making a level is random and messy. At least in my opinion. There's a better, like, visual way you can make challenges that doesn't look like you just kind of spam stuff everywhere. Oh, damn it. Get above the water. There we go. So I need to find where those last two coins are. So let me go check in this little ruin area over here, I guess. Again, all this looks kind of random. I don't know if there's any particular reason why these areas are the way they are. But yeah, so far I'm I'm not too impressed. Just because I feel like visually the level, at least underwater, looks like a bunch of stuff just thrown together. Now I see there's a arrow over here. No. I'm assuming there's eventually going to be a thing to lower the water. I will say that is another thing that's 
really annoying about this map so far is it's so closed in that the camera just doesn't know what to do. And you typically want to avoid tight spaces where the camera is going to do that. Yeah, it looks like I need two more red star or red coins, I think, to get that star. And I'm at the last two. Oh, I see another one right there. So yeah, all the red coins are just in this kind of mess of mess of uh, mines, which is. Yeah, it's an interesting choice. Uh, I get what you're going for here. It's kind of an odd way to do it. And yeah, I don't know if I'm, like, just not seeing this last one or what. Really hurry up and get more air. All right. Yeah, I wish there was a better way to like look around. I'm, I haven't played like I've said before in these videos. I'm not somebody who grew up with Mario 64, so I did play it when I was a kid, but I had to borrow it. So I really don't have the most experience with this game. So if I'm missing, like, key mechanics or finding a way to fight the ca not fight the camera, then that is entirely on me, and I am sorry. So there's the Red Queen Star. Let's just swim out of here and get our health back. And let's go for the star. Here we go! That is the first star down. Six more to go. Now, I haven't checked out these switches yet, so let me go see if I can even press one of those switches while I'm underwater. I want to say no, but I'm not entirely sure. Yeah, I don't think I can press them while I'm underwater. I like a tunnel over here. Maybe there's something... I'm still convinced that at one point I'm going to have to lower the water level. There's something. But for now, let's go back up top. Got some booze duck under there. Crap is this. There's a Metal Mario cap. cap. Whoa! 
yeah, I'm gonna have to duck, like, dock some really serious points off for the performance on this level. Like, I'm, I'm sorry, but if your level runs like this, you need to do a lot of trimming. Damn it. Just, I guess. Don't tell me I'm gonna need an invisible cap all the way up here. Okay, I, I get what I'm supposed to do now. I got it, I got it. on this level of abysmal. I might just not even finish it, honestly. And that's something that I really don't want to do. I never want to start a level and not get all the stars. But man, this is just not fun to play with the performance. You really need to cut down your level if you're getting this much lag while you're playing. our second star. That's the highest point of the map star. Well, maybe not. It looks like there's even more over there, honestly. What the hell? Try to go back down this way. Yeah. I wonder what I'm supposed to do with this. See what I'm supposed to do with it now. Okay.
I'm assuming you can't wall jump when you are that Mario now. Oh my god. This is going to be annoying as hell. I will say that much. Because I know what I need to do. Problem is, I already got rid of most of the blocks. Or not blocks, the coins. And I'm assuming there is one path that I need. So it looks like... One, two, three... What, the fourth path? I guess? I might can do it. They've been playing this for 16 minutes. 16 minutes and only two stars. That's not very, uh, very encouraging. I, I really don't want a marathon session like yesterday. I said the fourth. I'm, I'm terrible at remembering things. I think I said the fourth left. So let's try this again. Come on, Mario. Do one, two, three, four. Jump. No. Come on, swim, 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 damn it. Swim, damn it. No, I really don't want to have to do this again. <sighs> oh, man. That was almost heart attack inducing. <laughs> There's our 80 coin star. So I have, what, four more to go? I did that for. Shit, 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 shit. Yeah, I'm not gonna get that one. down, my god. That's too tall. Over here. This is so frustrating, man. I really want to like this level. Like, it has some really cool ideas, just... My god, is it a chore to play. How to defeat these things. I think you just have to run around on. Oh. 
that. If there's a way I can just triple jump up there. We can slow down, man. Yeah, made it up here. say good things about it. I really do. Because I like a lot of the ideas, but... The man playing this is a chore. Like a really big chore. Questioning what the point of over there is if that is if um, this leads to the same area. I think it might. Well, no, that might re lead to the red block. I'm not, I'm not, the blue switch, I mean, sorry. So that's four stars. Here we go. Yeah. yeah, I'm assuming that over there is eventually going to lead up there. Maybe. Made it over here like this. Don't know what I can do over here though. I think there is anything I can do over here, honestly. and try to do that one thing again where I climb across the bars and see what's over there. So, go. It's just depth perception while you're doing this is really difficult. I almost wished it was a top-down view that I could do. say the lag might be caused by having so many of those, what are they called, the, the mines. Now I can't tell how far it is. Oh my god. Get up there, Mario. No. 
see that there's a blue point switch inside of that, which I don't really need. I was really hoping for a quick level and uh, I'm not gonna get a quick level. <laughs> Not above cheesing levels if I have to. If it's taking me an hour per level, I would much rather just cheese it a little bit. Okay, so I'm in between this one. You gotta be kidding me. You have got to be kidding me. Sorry for whoever built this level. Subjecting myself to or subjecting them to my terrible playing. Because I guarantee you, this is a lot easier than I'm making it look. I'm just I am doing really bad right now. Wish there was a way I could just like backwards long jump or something on top of that. I wouldn't have to deal with this damn challenge. That I can never judge the distance on. These next few stars are all in the same place. Okay. There's blue switch. Oh! Oh, 
okay. Are you serious? My death perception is so bad on these and you want me to do even more? I will say the trick with the uh, platforms down there was really creative and cool. So that's, that's gonna get some props from me. Damn it. But I will say I really hope all of these stars are kind of in the same spot or something because I really need to get some sleep for work. Hold on. Ah! Beat that. Now watch there be no way for me to get down there though. Did, did he know? I think he knew. I think he knew. <sighs> Damn it! <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> oh man. I thought I outsmarted it, and no I didn't. That's kind of funny. to stop right there. Well, I see there's a star. So that'll be star number five of seven. It wouldn't be nearly as bad if I, I feel like the setup to get back to where you can try again is a little annoying. Ooh. Oh, that was close. You've got to be kidding me. I was right there. Can't tell where I'm going, damn it. Are you kidding? Whoever made this level has it in for me. They, they know I'm suffering right now. And I bet they're enjoying it too. Holy shit, that was close. Okay. 
No, no, no. See this face? This this is the face of someone who is defeated. You have defeated me, good sir. I am Okay. If I can just get past these damn balls. I want to cry. I want to cry. Uh, I'm 36 minutes in. I have to get up in like three hours. I thought this was going to be like a quick 30 minute video. This might be the first level that I do not finish. And it's it's not for lack of trying. Like, I, I really want to beat every level that I play. It's just... I was not expecting this to take this long. Get it. Here we go. That's five stars. Yeah. Now, where are the other two? I have a feeling that one of them is going to be that down there. Because, yeah, I'm at five stars of seven. So. Let's go for it. I'm at 39 minutes, so... At some point, I'm assuming I'm going to be lowering or raising the water level. Seems like. Get up there, Mario! Get up there, damn it! Get up there, damn it! Come on! Oh! oh
Is there a way I can just fall? Go like that. Make it a little bit faster. Swim, Mario, swim, swim, damn it. Swim, motherfucker. Get up there. Okay. No. No, do not. Do not hit the damn block. Okay. Ooh. God, that timing window is, is so fucking tight. Jesus Christ. See, here's what I don't know. Fucking get over here. No, dude. Don't. No, 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 no. No. There we go. Okay, so not, let me look safely. Because I cannot remember where this damn thing is. I thought it was at the edge of this, but I could be wrong. I want to say it's over there, but I'm not sure. And then I fall. And then I fucking fall. Oh, why? Why? Why does this level have to be like this? What kind of sadistic son of a bitch made this? Because I think it's over here. Yeah, it's right there. I need to make all those jumps. Forty-four minutes. I really want to get through this level by the end of the hour. I'm sorry if I seem a little pissed off in this video. I'm not really pissed off, I'm more just frustrated because I really wanted this to be more of a quick and easy. I didn't know what I was getting myself into when I downloaded this level. Because again, it didn't really have any plays that have one thumbs up. And that was it. So I didn't really know what to think when I started playing it. And oh, it's not disappointing when it comes to the rage factor. It's, it's this damn one right here. It's this one right here is a pain in my ass. Because what ends up happening is I end up, like, botching that last jump. And then, come on, swim, Mario, swim, motherfucker. God damn it! Oh, you've got to be fucking kidding me. Uh, 
I'm gonna wait. I, I took too long. Oh man. You can tell I'm getting frustrated. Then, yeah, yeah, I, I'm getting pretty frustrated right now. just executing this damn like if this was easier this little section right here it wouldn't be nearly as frustrating <clears throat> but I feel like the the last jumps on this are just sadistic <laughs> like the timing window that you have to jump on there is ridiculously short and I fucked it up again god damn it I say I fucked it up again, but I actually made it. Okay, so it's just this last part right here. I need to actually focus and not fall too close to the edge. Okay, we'll go. Come on, get up there, Mario. Get up there. Get up there. Fucking get up there. Come on, I'm not doing this shit again. Come on, let's get it. Let's get it! Fucking finally! <laughs> Fucking finally. Oh, man. That feels so good, you don't even know. That feels so good. Now, I'm wondering what this last star is because I see a platform to raise and lower the water. So I'm not quite sure I haven't had to raise and lower the water yet. Let me go over to that thing. Okay. That just... Holy shit, what the fuck? What the fuck? What is this shit? How do I get in there? Secret cave or something? Well, I see that. Can't hit it though. Okay. under here. Let me go back in there and see if there's anything. If I can even make it down here. We have a King Boo. Hold on. Hold on a damn minute. What is all this? Okay, that's... 
That's clever. I like that. Okay, this this level, it's pissing me off, but I, I'm really enjoying some of the design. It's... Well, if I could actually get up to fucking room... I think I'm finally about to beat this level. It was almost an hour long. This was frustrating, but my god, I'm gonna feel on top of the world once I get that last star. Like, here we go, here we go. All seven stars, it took me 52 minutes. That's about the same time that it took me for the last level. I don't know what it is with me these like past few levels, if I'm just rusty or what, but my god. So overall, what do I think of this level? So that star is a really good star. The only star that I would say I, I really didn't enjoy was hanging from the grates and, and going across because I feel like the depth perception is a little hard to judge with the camera system. And then the red coin star was not really it for me either because visually it was a mess. However, the get up there to get up there with the invisible cap or intangible cap or whatever it's called, that one's really awesome. And then using the metal Mario cap to push those three switches was really clever that second one maybe <laughs> i wish there was a way you could make the timing window just a little bit longer somehow i don't know how you could do that but once i finally did it i felt like i was on top of the world so i i can't really say it's a bad star it's a good star it's just a frustrating star uh 80 coins was a little low i guess because i ended up with 175 maybe keep the max coins around 120-ish or so. And then I really did like getting to the star with the red grate because over here, oh, I just, I did a stupid. I did a stupid. I just jumped down while the switch, hold on, hold on a fucking minute. Wait a minute. So you're telling me that I could have did that one star first and then I wouldn't have the fucking hassle. Oh my god. Okay, so you might want to patch that when you're when you're going through and, and testing and, and redoing your level. You might want to patch that because I could get out of that hole without raising the water level again. And that would make this coin star really trivial to get. Except for this one. I feel like getting up here is actually going to be a little bit of a challenge, but you don't really need to, honestly, because, you know, you can press the switch down there already. So that's something you need to watch out for. You need to find a way to make it so you can't get out of that area without raising the water level somehow. <clears throat> Other than that, <clears throat> let's go for a final rating. I'm gonna give this level, I'm trying to weigh the performance issues with the geniusness of the stars, <clears throat> because the stars were really good. Aside from the frustrations with the, the climbing one, I feel like the depth perception could have been a little bit better. And then I feel like the setup for the stars, I wish there was a way you could do a checkpoint system. I know it's not in the game yet, but overall, 
If you can fix the issues with the lag, honestly, I think you need to do away with the red coin star or find a different way to do it. Because maybe that'll reduce the lag. Let's say overall this is a 7 out of 10. And the only reason why I'm getting giving it a 7 out of 10 is because while the coins, I feel like, or the stars were actually really difficult, I feel like I'm on top of the world right now, so that, that feeling is amazing. And if you could just get rid of the lag on this level and patch up that thing so I can't get out of there and, and cheese this star, I wish I would have found that out sooner. <laughs> it would have been a lot easier for me, but I would always want to do it the, the real way anyway. So uh, I'll give it a 7 out of 10. I did really like the level, just you need to tweak it some. Find a way to remove some unnecessary platforms, like these over here. You don't really need to connect them to the ground, I don't think. Because when you're Metal Mario, you know, you can get to the platforms. It's, it's not like you need all of this architecture, so to speak. And that could help reduce the lag, maybe remove a little bit of the enemies. Because, trust me, this level is already difficult enough for some of the stars without the enemies. So, just find a way to optimize this level, do a version 2 where you can't get out of that one room without raising the water level back. And then do away with the red coin star or find another way to do the red coins. And then find a way to simplify the level geometry a little bit so that performance is better. And then this will be like a an 8 to a 9 out of 10. Visually, it is not great. It's literally very blocky and doesn't use much textures. That's not really a bad thing though for this level because this one's so gameplay oriented that I didn't really care as much for the, you know, the flat visuals, so to speak. I do feel like the underwater mines or the, the Bowser mines could have been, I don't know. You just need to do away with that. That looks like a mess. But otherwise, yes, I, I did really enjoy myself with this level even though I got very frustrated. That's part of the enjoyment, and I'll give it a 7 out of 10. And if you like this video, please leave a like, comment, and tell me what you thought of this level. Try to play it yourself, and you'll probably demolish, you know, my time. But, I don't know. I just, something with me the past two days hasn't been really good. And then if you dislike the video, please go ahead and leave a dislike, but go down to the comments section and tell me what I can improve on. And... Be sure to subscribe to the channel for more Mario Boulder 64, and I will see you guys in the next video.